Another important source of inspiration for Motorzone Becker was antique art. The first work is by Benjamin Britten and matches the level of intensity of this painting. The second work is a movement of a cello suite by Bach. Welcome and thank you for joining us for our video series Miniatures Inspired by Visual Arts and Music. With us today is violinist Tosca Optam, founder and artistic director of the Miniatures series. And this series brings together classical music and visual arts. Tosca has taken her inspiration from different paintings in the exhibition, in the picture, portraying the artist. And together with fellow musicians, she will perform musical pieces from a wide range of composers. In each episode, we look at one or two paintings in the exhibition, and Tosca will share with us what it is that inspires her about these artworks. For this miniature, we take a close look at one of the self-portraits of the German artist Paula Modersohn Becker. It was generously lent to us by the Paula Modersohn Becker Stiftung in Bremen. It is one of a total of 35 painted self-portraits by Modersohn Becker, exactly the same number of self-portraits Vincent van Gogh painted. During her short artistic career, Paula Modersohn Becker was particularly interested in the human figure. Narrative is absent from most of her figure studies. Existence itself is the subject of her art and her self-portraits show a great power of expression. The renowned poet Rainer Maria Rilke, who was close to Modersohn Becker, believed that she was wholly original. He claimed that she painted things never before seen or painted by anyone and in her uniqueness as an artist, he compared her to Vincent van Gogh. Another important source of inspiration for Modersohn Becker was antique art. She sought to achieve the same simplicity of form, and in this particular self-portrait, she used a similar close-up frontal composition. And what's more, she didn't differentiate between the pupils and the irises of her eyes, and the result is a self-portrait with a disconcerting appearance. To embrace this portrait musically, I was guided by a few elements. The first being the nearness of the face. One is captivated by Modersohn Becker's intense and direct expression. A pairing of two works for solo cello feels apt. A close-up in miniature pieces paired with a close-up of cellist Quirina Viersen. The first work is by Benjamin Britten and matches the level of intensity of this painting. The second work is a movement of a cello suite by Bach and also represents a sense of reaching back in time to learn from the great composers of a former era. As Bach was a touchstone for so many composers, so Modersohn Becker found inspiration in ancient Egyptian art. Both compositions and the painting make for an expressive representation of the inner self.
Thank you. 